Oh, oh, wait. Oh, wait. All right, what's going on YouTube? It is day two out of 120 days. We are uploading every single day of the summer. Today in Cold War and Warzone, the new Amp 63 gun, pistol, whatever you want to call it, came out today. And I went out of my way today on stream and already got a Dark Aether so you guys can see how good it looks. I made a dual wheel class and I also made a normal class. So we're going to hop into Nuketown and use this for the very first time because I really don't know how this gun works or what it's like. I heard that it's kind of like a pocket AK-74U so I'm kind of excited to use this. And uh, yeah, we're just going to hop right into some Nuketown. Alright, so I think I'm gonna hop into use the duo first, but actually let's just take a moment and look at that. Ooh, wee, they're dual. So yeah, we're we're using the dual wield one first. And we're gonna see how this competes. Okay, I mean he was literally absolutely one shot, so that's not fair. And I got absolutely gunned by an LC10, so I don't know if that's fair either, to be honest. But you know what? We're just gonna we're gonna see what the vibes are, alright? Let's it's not really meant for range, so I don't wanna like treat this as like Okay, I'm getting gunned by LC10s. I didn't know we we're still in December, or what? February? Did that come out in February? February? Not December. Mac 10 was December. Okay, uh, I'm I'm getting gunned by literally everything. Like they're they're cool, I guess. Sometimes I'll say six. Sometimes. Oh! Oh! Wait! Oh! Wait! Oh, oh, wait, oh, okay. Hey, hold on. Wait. Uh, hey, yo, low key. It kind of does go crazy. I don't know, like, the. I don't know if I have, like, a good build or not. Like, I don't know, like, the range, like, the, we're, we're, like, aiming for here, to be honest. That's why I'm, I don't, I just. Okay. Like, from the challenges? He put a proximity mine. There, okay. Uh, once again, LC tens. You know, it's it's a little it's a dangerous game with this LC ten that they're using. It's hard. Okay, okay. Let's 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 try without a duel. Let's let's see if this is like maybe it's like a pocket SMG. It's hard to like. I don't know to use a dual wheel, I feel like. Okay, there's one. There's two. Okay, uh, LC10 is still, an SMG is still basically gonna dominate you. There's no way, like, I, so close range is pretty dominant, actually. But the problem that I have is that you don't have range with it. But it's pretty, it, yeah, this is actually pretty decent, actually. I, I, mean, I like using the non-dual one a little bit more here because it, I have way more accuracy than I feel like I would normally have. So yeah, I, I, I like this a little bit more here. I think I could change like a couple more settings on like not, not settings, but I think I could change like a couple more attachments on this. And I think we're, we're chilling to be honest. It, it It's decent, it's not terrible, but yeah, it's, I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep using it and see. Oh, so yeah, I did use this a little bit in Warzone. I I got like the blueprint or whatever you want to call it. It's called blueprint, right? Yeah, I got that. It was like ten dollars. I figured I'd get it for uh, to see what's up. But this gun's actually pretty easy to unlock in in um in zombies. You have to get like four hundred headshots in zombies, which is literally like nothing. But yeah. Hey, there we go. Kind of popping off now, a little bit. Like I could go on sprees, but this kid with all right, bro. Do I have to pull my LC10 and just dominate this kid? Switching back. I'm switching. Back. I want to use a dual wheel again. I want to. I want to like really testify this and see if I could actually like use it. Okay, I mean that works. That's not bad. Okay. Hey, now wait a minute, man. Man, maybe maybe it's not too bad, you know? 
Maybe, you know, maybe I was giving that a little bit, a little bit of a hard time, but maybe it's not as bad as I, it seems. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I, did I run out of bullets? Oh, I'm actually might have just ran out of bullets. This gun doesn't have that many bullets. And constantly running over scabs is kind of... I literally saw a name tag about that. Dude, I can't... I can't see anything, bro. What what am I supposed to see? Nice. Easy sometimes, baby. Easy, 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 easy. Okay. Alright, easy win, bro. 35 and 33. I'm basically in the CDL. And look at a final kill cam here. Hey, what more can you do here, man? Look at that. Somebody shot me, not even care in the world. I, did, I haven't got to kill in like 10 minutes. Oh my god, okay. One, two, reload, three. Not bad. Four. Hey, bro. Kind of goaded. All right, boys, well, that's going to wrap it up for me. If you guys did enjoy today's episode, make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe. It would help out a tremendous amount with the YouTube algorithm, pushing my content more on the recommended. If you guys are interested in the class setups I used, I don't know if I put this in the beginning of the video, but I'll put it here again. I was using a dual wield with SOCOM Eliminator. The barrel was the 6.4 Task Force. The body was the 5 millimeter meter laser magazine was just a fast mag i would probably change this for like a 25 round mag or something for betterness and then obviously dueled for that class and then my other class that i had was the socom eliminator the task force barrel uh city aim laser uh 25 round mag and then the airborne elastic but uh, yeah that's gonna wrap it up for me thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys in the next one all right goodbye boys